A new year ushers in a new law. Gun owners just began registering to obtain concealed carry permits. After completing a 16-hour course with a certified instructor, they can then carry their weapons where the law allows. Dave Farrell of Libertyville has applied for a permit. You know, it's a lot of responsibility to have uh, to carry, and so uh, it's mainly for protection uh, and to uh, protect others, too, if the, if the case may be. Authorities estimate as many as 400,000 people will apply for the permits this year alone. Again. Chris Howell is a Chicago lawyer who has completed the training program. It's a surprisingly diverse uh, background of people um, from 21 up to the 70s. Men and women, it's almost 50-50. Mm -hmm. um, there's ev every ethnic background there. Uh, a lot of skilled uh, firearm owners, uh, a lot of that are not skilled. There definitely needs to be a little bit of uh, prerequisite class taking or being able to demonstrate to a licensed instructor that you know how your gun operates and just the very basics of you know, pulling the trigger, uh, what that means, where to keep your hands, how to hold the weapon, and to that effect. The new law, however, does not apply to DePaul. Signs have gone up around campus, reminding students, faculty, and staff that the university strictly prohibits students and employees from carrying firearms on campus. Most students seem to agree with that policy. I think, I think it's okay to have guns, but I don't, I don't believe in concealed carry. I don't think they should be allowed. I have mixed feelings about it. Um, I think for the people that aren't out there to do violent crimes, it is good. It protects them against others. Uh, well, I'm a law student, um, so I believe in the like Second Amendment, um, but I don't think you need AK-47s to go hunting. Just to like preface my views on that, it's a little bit nuanced, um, but certainly I'm okay with concealed carry. The new law also prohibits carrying guns in many other places like courts, parks, and libraries. Tom Dorsch is the Director of Operations at On Target Range and Tactical Training Center in Crystal Lake, Illinois. What we add uh, that isn't mandated by the Illinois State Police is the psychological um, um, effects of dealing with uh, the aftermath of a shooting. And we, we go through the, how to read a situation, how to avoid situations. Uh, so our class is a mixture of not only marksmanship, but a bit of sociology, uh, psychology, emotions, uh, threat analysis. And what we try to do is deliver an overall uh, sobering picture of what it's going to be like to actually carry a handgun in the state of Illinois. Permits could take up to 90 days to be processed, meaning in April, there will be legally armed citizens walking the streets in Illinois.